Hey guys, so I just got done editing um, my last video and that video was a vlog style and I just vlogged a few days and just random stuff I was doing and I thought it'd be kind of boring and maybe it was for you guys, I have no idea. But for some reason to me it was so much fun and it was so much fun watching back and I don't know, I feel like these will be the type of videos that'll be really cool to look back on like and show my kids and be like, yeah, this was just a random day in your mom's life and stuff like that and grand kids and everything else like I don't know I think it'll be really cool to look back on one day and for some reason it's just so fun to me to just like vlog what's going on in my life and I have no idea why but yeah I really couldn't wait to make another one so right now I'm gonna go clean my pig pen and then after that I actually have a 4-H meeting and it's kind of a nerve-wracking one because I have demonstrations and if you guys don't know what that is it's like you have to demonstrate something to your 4-H group and I'm going to show how to take pictures on a Polaroid camera and yeah it's kind of cool because one of my projects is photography not off of a Polaroid camera but it's still kind of in the same family so it's kind of cool that I'm doing something related to one of my actual projects so yeah gonna go clean the pig pen now. Hi piggy piggies. <laughs> oh my. So we have to lock them out here. We had to close off their house because we're gonna clean it. So this is the first time to ever be locked outside. They seem like they're doing okay though. All Mikey cares about is that food. <laughs> They're still a little scared of me because they're still little. But eventually they won't be scared anymore. Hi guys. Hi. They're probably gonna start biting me here in a second. Hi buddy. Hello, so I'm going for a walk around the field in the back of my house. It has to be kind of quick, like I can't be slow about it because I have the 4-H meeting in a little less than a half an hour. Luckily, it's actually kind of close where the 4-H meeting is at. So I really wanted to go for a walk because I think it's supposed to get cold again and it's really nice today and I wanted to enjoy it. I love walking around the field with my dog. I don't know if you can see her, but yeah. I love walking around this field with her, during the summer, we go pretty much every day. I think I mentioned it's like about a mile long. I'm not really sure, but I think once I had one of those like things that count how much you're walking, it said about a mile. So, I don't know, it just makes me feel really good. Like, it makes my body feel really good to walk around it. And I know it's good for her. So, yeah, I just love it. And it's so beautiful out here. I just love looking at the scenery out here. It's crazy, this is right behind my house because it's so gorgeous out here. You're so cute, Kissy. Yeah, you're a beautiful girl, huh? I'm literally so screwed right now. So I was like almost there and I was already kind of short. And then I realized I forgot my Polaroid at home for my demonstration. So I called my friend Julie and I told her I'd be late to let them know. So I'm gonna be like 10 something, 15 minutes freaking late. Cause, and I knew I'd forget it. Like I was like, I know I'm gonna forget this. And I was like, I need to go set it downstairs and I just never got a chance to. So yeah, this really sucks. Hey guys, so I'm back from the 4-H meeting and it really sucked that I forgot my Polaroid but I went home and got it and everything went fine. Well, actually it didn't go fine. The demonstration went really bad. I forgot to turn it on and I was wondering why I didn't take a picture. So that was fun. But yeah, everyone was really nice about that. I totally didn't know what I was doing with my Polaroid. And yeah, so I'm really glad it's over. Um, right now, I'm probably going to work on some schoolwork. I have a project for my college and careers class that I took because I thought I was going to do this program at my school where you go work half day and I had to take this class to do that, but I decided not to do it. So it kind of sucks that I'm taking this class for no reason now, but I am, so I might as well finish it and get the credit. So I have a project to work on for that class and I also have anatomy to study for and hopefully I'll get to do a little bit of both of those things and after that I am going to take a shower. It just hit me today. I just realized that exactly four weeks from today, around this time of day actually, I will be in the same room as Andy Black. 
Like, the concert isn't exactly four weeks, and I think the concert starts at, like, 7.30. It's a little after 7.30, and so it'll probably be, like, the opening bands right now, but at this time in four weeks, I will be, like, very close to being in the same room as Andy Black, but, like, oh my gosh, that is crazy. Like, I I was obsessed with Blackville Rides back in middle school, and, like, the fact that I'm actually going to meet Andy, well, I don't know if you consider a concert meeting someone, but I like to consider it that way. I don't really know if it counts, but I like to say that I'm meeting him, and that is insane. Oh my gosh. So literally the title of this vlog should be running late because guess what guys, I'm running late again. I have to be in class in 20 minutes and I'm still at my house. So I got up kind of later than I have been the rest of the week and I've been broadcasting every day in the morning all week and when I get up on a decent time, it's not a bad thing. But I was like, you know what, I'm just going to broadcast for 15 minutes. 35 minutes later, here we are. The broadcast was going really well and I didn't want to end it. So yeah, that's good. Um, I'm really glad it went well and if any of you came from the broadcast, hello. But um, yeah, now I'm running super late. So that sucks, but I should still get there in time, hopefully. It'll be cutting it close though. Like the 4-H meeting, hopefully I don't forget anything like the 4-H meeting. Hello everyone, so I just uploaded my last vlog. Well, I haven't uploaded it. I have it set up to premiere at 7. I feel like that's kind of annoying to do premieres, but I've uploaded so many videos. It's just nice to do some different stuff, not just always do the same thing. So it changes things up a little bit. But anyways, I did that. Now I'm going to take care of the cats and do their litter, food, water, and vac my room. And then I'm going to study. And then... After that, I have um, to go to the school and take some pictures for a yearbook of like a choir thing or something like that. And then Michael's going to come over after work. So it's going to be a busy night, but if I have any extra time, I do want to write. But I don't know if I'm going to have any time to write. But if I did have any extra time, that's how I plan to spend it. So yeah, that is the agenda for this Wednesday night. So I almost forgot, I also had to work on a project for school that's due Friday. So that's another thing on top of everything else I already have to do tonight, so. Hey guys, so I am writing right now. And it's really hard to focus because this kitty kitty over here wants lovin's and I want to give him a lovin's. But yeah, my friend Randa's supposed to get home in like 15 minutes and then we're gonna FaceTime until I leave to go take pictures for 4-H. Oh, he's so cute. You are so cute. Look at him. Oh. So I'll like, when I edit, I'll put that I messed up, but it, I was just watching it back. Sometimes I just watch back after I record. I honestly wanted to see the pictures of Fluffy, and I heard myself say, take pictures of 4-H. I'm taking pictures for yearbook. I don't know why I said that. Probably because of the 4-H meeting yesterday, but yeah. Too much going on, but I'm not taking pictures for 4-H. I'm taking pictures for yearbook. I need to get my stuff together. Do you want kisses? Probably not, but I'll pet you. Hey guys, so I am leaving to take yearbook pictures right now. So the new video just premiered and this is how stupid I am. I thought premiering just was kind of a fancy way of scheduling your video to upload and it had like a countdown and everything which I thought was cute but I didn't realize it was like an actual live broadcast and I did it before and I just must have not noticed but I'm never doing that again unless you guys like really like that type of thing because I thought that was weird. I'll do scheduled videos but not the whole premiere thing because I don't like that it's live because if you don't click on it right when it starts then it's like in the middle of the video and you're like what the heck is going on so yeah I, did. I just thought premiere meant that it was a countdown and it was just like a cuter words for schedule I didn't know that's what premiere meant <laughs> but I guess that's what it means so yeah probably won't ever do that again but who knows I might but at this point it's weird and I don't, I don't like it so he's amazing and he just bought me a bunch of makeup that I'll show you guys everything later but I love you what is that one I don't know uh, oh yeah, the guy told me yeah. The guy, I, I think it's the coolest thing ever. Like, it goes like this. Like, which way is it open? Like, 
that. Yeah. I know what this is. I don't know what that stuff is. And then it opens to that. And then it comes down. This stuff comes out. I know that. Hang on. Wait a second. That's cool. Yeah, it's a mirror. And there's other stuff that comes out. Oh, yeah, I don't know what that stuff is. That's this it. This is so pretty. That's, That's it. so nice. Yeah, the um, concealer. You didn't see it on the back? There's a picture of what it looks like. Put it on your hand. Oh, okay. This is makeup primer, and for whatever reason, he's telling me to put it on my hand. You probably gotta turn it, because it's new. So, I showed you guys, we're about to watch YouTube, but I showed you guys this concealer, and then there's a bunch of different stuff in here, and then showed you the face primer, which I've never even had primer before, so that's exciting, and then there's this uh, reusable makeup remover cloth, which is cool, because it's good for the environment. Yeah, it is. Mm, don't leave. Hey guys, so Michael just left. It's almost 10.30 and I still need to take a shower. And you know, it sounds crazy, but it's still gonna take me like an hour to get ready. And yeah, there's just like a ton I still have to do. Like it takes me about an hour to get ready on an average night, which I'm gonna try and go quicker. I know I do, so maybe I can get it done like 40 to 50 minutes. But yeah, tonight it's gonna be a late one. So, same situation as yesterday. I'm putting my stuff in my car and I still have to drive to school. And I have to be there in 20 minutes. I have to be in class in 20 minutes, sitting in class. And I have to drop, up the, drop off the yearbook camera. So, yeah, fun. We're on our way to JCPenney's and possibly Maurice's, maybe. <laughs> Hey guys, so I just got home from shopping. All we bought was some Easter eggs from Walmart because we are having, now we're not having an Easter party, but we're going to an Easter party and they need more eggs for the kids to go egg hunting. So yeah, I'm so, today's just not my day. You know, this week has honestly been better than most. Like the last three days, Monday through Wednesday, have been like really good compared to how weeks normally go for me but today has just sucked but i i can't complain because normally almost every single one of my days are like today and i've had a little good last three days so i can't really complain but oh i'm just so miserable today so you guys will be proud of me i normally the last two days have left 20 minutes before class starts today. I have 22. I have two extra minutes today. So happy for myself. <laughs> I'm always late for literally everything. So my friend Juliana has a friend over here right now and um, they're downstairs hanging out and I just came up here to talk to Michael and now I think I'm gonna take a nap. We're gonna go to Hacienda later in bowling and I just feel really tired and I wanna give them some time because they don't really know each other that much yet. So I wanna give them time like alone to get to know each other some. And I'm just tired too, so I might end up taking a nap. I don't normally take naps, but I feel like I could today. I wanted to be like serious. Legit? <laughs> sure. Okay. Will you take a pictures? Yeah. So we just left Tassie and uh, Juliana and her man are in the, they're driving separately. Now we're on the way to the bowling alley. Can I officially call him her man? Because I mean they're going to prom together. Oh, but, yeah. but they aren't like dating, but they're going to prom together. So I'm gonna just, that's what we're gonna call him because when I was recording earlier, I was like, Juliana has her friend and I winked here. <laughs> We're bowling. Oh. So we didn't even know, but it's glow bowling. They just shut off the light. And normally you have to reserve for glow bowling, but they had an extra one. So we got to glow bowl without even reserving. 
Oh wow, she actually bowled right this time and still didn't make it. You still didn't make it. <laughs> Yeah, record. You get. You get it. Yeah, I love you too. <laughs> well, we're in the bathroom right now. Nice bathroom. We had to go pee. <laughs> Fun stuff, you know. Just so cool that to watch us go in the bathroom. You know, it's so entertaining. <laughs> we are an absolute power couple. He got first at bowling, and I got second. We beat both of them. Like. We're just the best couple and now we're going to try and get back to the house before them and we are because we're taking the highway and they're no, taking they back there. roads. Yeah, we're definitely going to get there before them. So we, we're just so powerful. No one can, can even compete with us. We're just good at everything. Don't you think? We're a power couple. Oh, yeah. Hi. Good morning. Good morning, piggy piggies. Just filled up their water, but they're sleepy this morning. Yeah, this is a sleep in Saturday, huh? Yeah. Instagram and ask you guys for some ideas on some new videos, things we haven't talked about yet. And so we are about to go grocery shopping. I'm also going to go visit Michael at work. And we're gonna go pick up some shoes I ordered online for JC Penney's for prom. So that's the plans for today. Also, while we're at Walmart, I'm probably gonna buy a big mirror for my room so I can have like a full mirror. I had used to have one, but when we redid my room, we took it out and I kind of want a bigger one because it was just, it was pretty small, but it was full size, but it was small and I really want a bigger and nicer one. So I'm gonna look and see if I see anything today and hopefully I will come back the nice new mirror. Mm -hmm. Is it working now? Yeah. That's good. Hey guys, so for the remainder of the night, me and my family went over to my parents' friend's house and then Michael met us over there and we hung out till pretty late. It's like 11.30 right now, so I'm going to take a shower and get ready for bed because I have a lot of studying ahead of me tomorrow. So, yeah, I need to get to bed to hear it very soon. That's what I'm saying. Why I can't study. But he's so cute, and I love him. Whenever I come up to my desk to get stuff done, he just comes and wants you to cuddle and me to love on him. Mm -hmm. He's so cute. Hi, piggies. <coughs> oh my gosh. What is your guys' problem? I've been out here for like a couple minutes and they literally did nothing. And then all of a sudden, I had even talked to them and then I brought my phone out and they like freaked out. You are so big. I swear, every day I go out here, you guys just get bigger and bigger. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hi. So right now, I'm eating watermelon and studying anatomy. I have so much studying to to do today. Oh, my brain is already fried from all the studying I've done. And here's Fluffy probably trying to steal watermelon that he'll just play with and not even eat because I try and give them like food every once in a while. Like I'll try and give them like a piece of popcorn that doesn't have like a ton of butter on it and stuff. They won't even eat it. They just play with it. But they always try and take my food but then they'll barely ever eat anything. I don't know. They don't like a lot of human food. They'll eat like ham but that's pretty much it. They don't want like popcorn. I don't know. There's so much stuff that they don't eat. They just play with so... It's kind of a good thing though. It's probably good that they don't like human food because I don't think a lot of human food is good for animals, but I don't really know. But yeah, I'm going to go back to studying now. I love this mirror so much. It is so freaking nice. Hello everyone. So I've been studying like all day. It's been crazy. The few minutes I've gotten off from studying, I've literally just been laying in my bed or on the couch and just like talking to my mom and looking out the window and giving my eyes a break from just staring at pieces of paper all day. But I will be taking a little break because I'm going to Michael's mom 
Michael's house because I have a gift to give her from Florida and Michael's gonna be over there and yeah I'm just I haven't I saw her once since we got back from Florida but I didn't know I was gonna see her so I didn't get to give her her gift yet and I'm very excited to see her and Michael and give her her gift so yeah I'm just gonna finish getting ready like I'm just gonna like fix myself up I guess I'm gonna like restraighten my hair and stuff and then I will be leaving to go do that and then once I get back my goal is to study as much more as I can and get ready for bed I honestly love this rainy type of weather and I feel like it's like the best weather if you're gonna do something like study so I was really grateful for this weather today which I'm probably in the minority in that because lots of people like sunshine and everything but I don't know if I'm gonna be outside I obviously don't want rain but if I'm gonna be inside like studying and stuff or like reading or writing and things like that rainy weather is the absolute best it's so cozy so before I wrap it all back up this is what I got Michael's mom and like it changes like I don't know how to explain it and you can see how like it's like I don't know how to the pink and like the way the dolphin and the mermaid look it looks different depending on how you turn it and it's just never seen anything like it it's super cool but yeah that's what I got her from Florida and I'm so excited to give it to her so it's getting cold out and now Rain and snow are mixed, and I'm going to be driving to Michael's mom. It's in that, and yeah, I'm not ready to drive in that crap, but I still really want to go over there, so I'm going to deal with it and put my car in four-wheel drive and hope for the best. So I'm getting ready for bed, and I just checked, and the Andy Black concert is 22 days, and... 19 hours away and that is so crazy and I'm getting so freaking excited but yeah it's like 11 o'clock at night and I still have to get ready for bed I take my shower I'm just like brushing my hair and stuff then I want to study a little bit before I go to bed so it's gonna be a late one tonight but tonight was so much fun went over there I gave Michael's mom his gift and she really liked it I think anyways and then we watched a movie and yeah we just all three of us had so much fun Hello everyone, it is Monday morning and I'm leaving for school, running about, I, I was about to say 20 minutes late, but I'm not running 20 minutes late, it's 20 minutes until class, which is normally about the time I leave and I hate it because it's not enough time because it's like a 10-15 minute drive, so yeah, stressed is normal. Hello everyone, so I am out watering my piggies and it's Monday night. I took my anatomy test today and I'm so relieved it's over. I have no idea how I did on it, but at least it's over. And I'm going to end this vlog here because it's probably already pretty long. And my friend Julie and I told her I'm including the pro her prom proposal in this video and she wants me to get it up because she wants to see it in the video. I told her that it'd be up by like Tuesday, Wednesday. So I need to end this here so I can start um editing it and things and it's like i said it's already going to be super long i have a feeling so yeah this is the end of this video i hope you guys enjoyed it and let me know if you want to keep seeing these vlogs i'm going to take a little break like i'm not going to start and write tomorrow but within a week or something i might start another one so if you guys would like me to do that let me know in the comments and i'll see you guys in my next video bye